take a whole number bigger than 2, let's say 5. If we square 5, we get 25. So now here's a curious fact. If we take 4, which is 1 less, and 6, which is 1 more than 5, and multiply those numbers together, we get 24, which is just 1 less than the square. So that's a, that's a fact, but this seems to work for bigger numbers as well. So the question is, is this always true? This is a time when you can pause the video and solve it on your own. The answer is yes, it is always true. And here is a very simple algebraic argument. Well, we just, instead of using a particular number, we just use x. Therefore, we can prove it for all numbers bigger than 2. And uh, simple cross multiplication shows that it's always x squared minus 1.